Hey guys, Joe Cabalos here, and before you ask, no, this, uh, this chair is not a Christmas present. Uh, I got, I have this chair since I was like, since I was like four, actually, think about it now. But, uh, hey guys, Joe Cabalos here, and, um, today I'm just gonna show a quick list of my, uh, Christmas presents for 2017. It's only fitting, since I did my, uh, did I, like, my summer get, like, my summer purchases for 2017 earlier this year, so it's like six months. So, yeah. So, the first thing I want to show is, uh, you, you kind of saw it on the top, so I'll just get this out of the way. A new pair of headphones. I don't really know what type of brand it is, and I don't really know the price. But, these headphones are pretty nice. Uh, they feel pretty comfortable. Here's the wire. The only problem is that there's no changeable cord, and I'm having a little bit of problems with it on Discord. So... While testing on Discord, though, everything else I tested works great with these. So, yeah. And this is also good in case my other pair of headphones die. There you go. The, the next thing is a Chrome Amiibo. Now, the Chrome Amiibo is really nice Amiibo. Uh, I'm just going to lay this down. And just look at this. Look at this detail. Unfortunately, it's getting a little bit blurry, but this is good for you. Should have... Probably should have uh, calibrated the thing. This looks really nice. Oops. It just looks really nice. I think the detail is really great. And yeah. Unfortunately, that's the only Amiibo I got. But we'll get into that later. And the last thing I want to show you is... Uh, what's that? Right, I just heard a sound. Uh, the last thing I got was a Nintendo Switch Pro Controller. Uh, the Nintendo Switch Pro Controller, of course, costs 70 bucks by the fall, but getting it through getting th through Christmas is a good bargain. And speaking of Nintendo Switch, uh, Red Cap notified me that like the e like during like during Christmas Day, the eShop was basically inaccessible due to how many people were downloading games. And in fact, there's still some sales going on there, so I might do something, but. I'll talk about that later. So, this controller feels really nice. Uh, a little bit better than I expected. The, the triggers, the triggers and bumpers do do need a little bit of work. I don't know. I can't remember how to access the uh, thanks all game fans thing. Unfortunately, it's like Chrome there. There you go. This looks really nice. Uh, only problem is that sometimes the left part of the D-pad accidentally presses up in addition. Which is a big problem. Like when you want to do like menu selections. So that's the only problem with it. That's pretty much it for this video. But I have a more enthusiastic question of the day. Um, so, so, so in addition to these three items, I also got a whopping $220 as well as a $25 eShop gift card. No, not eShop. GameStop. Uh, so I asked you, what should I buy with my 220 to 245 dollars? What should I buy? Of course, all of it is physical money, so I gotta pick somewhere. So that that's basically it for this video. I'm obviously gonna buy at least one amiibo and maybe one game for my Switch, since there are a lot of games on sale, like Shovel Knight, uh, Horses, uh, Mario and Rabbits. There's a lot of things on sale right right now. So uh. That's pretty much it for this video, and I'll uh, see you guys next time. And uh, I might I might do a live stream now, maybe. But uh, see you guys next time.